SCP-001. The following files have been classified top secret by order of the administrator. General Notice 001-Alpha. In order to prevent knowledge of SCP-001 from being leaked, several or no false SCP-001 files have been created alongside the true file or files. All files concerning the nature of SCP-001, including the decoy or decoys, are protected by a mimetic kill agent designed to immediately cause cardiac arrest in any non-authorized personnel attempting to access the file. Revealing the true nature or natures of SCP-001 to the general public is cause for execution, except as required under... SCP-001, The Prototype, Item Designation Number, 86243-AR-001. Warning, Item Displays Aggressive and Dangerous Behavior. Description of Item, 6 foot 5 inches tall, 97 pounds, average, varies by 5 to 10 pounds higher or lower. Unknown age, gray-brown skin, may be bruising. Eye color, milky blue, no hair. Emaciated appearance, bone and muscle structure unlike any recorded species. Legs are long and thin, ending in sharp black points. Three fingers on each hand, also ending in black points. Legs and arms are twice as long as torso. No reproductive organs, anal orifice, ears, nose, or pores anywhere on the body. Head is spherical, very large in proportion to body. Neck appears too thin to support head. Mouth extends halfway around head, no lips. 21 teeth spaced randomly around mouth. Many appear broken, rotten, or chipped. Eye is a large, ball-shaped, milky blue sphere, presumably kept in the head or throat appears to roll into the mouth when mouth is open, has no pupil or iris. Detail of current containment. Room is lead-lined and kept lit with floodlights. Temperature is kept at 98 degrees with 100% humidity. Room is sealed with a reinforced steel blast door. Outer area patrolled by guards with high-powered strobes. Anybody entering the containment room should carry a strobe and wear welding goggles. Any person attempting to remove the item or enter without authorization is to be shot on sight. Report. Recovered in Guatemala early this week. First reported as a demon seen by several boys on a rural road. Appeared to be sick or injured. Boys reported seeing the creature panting and jerking its legs creature then raised its head and exposed its eye. Boys ran home, reporting to local law enforcement. Several reports of horrible roaring, or shrieks, from locals over several days. Twelve people admitted to local hospital with severe radiation poisoning, and seven reported missing. Recovery team assembled, headed by General McCoy and dispatched from base ADRX-19. Reports to overseers from recovery team after standard containment failure led to additional containment protocols developed by Dr. Herman Ketter. Dr. Ketter was unfortunately killed in initial testing, after which Creature was moved to ADRX-19. Creature appears to be able to create micro-singularities, using them both as a form of teleportation and defense. These singularities disappear several seconds after creation, but emit massive amounts of radiation and cause severe damage to the surrounding area. The eye appears to control these manifestations, as it has always had the eye exposed when creating a singularity. Omnivorous, it views humans as a food supply. Creature shows signs of extreme fear and sickness in the presence of high heat, humidity, or bright flashing light. Creature appears unable to teleport through lead, and cannot form singularities when in its sick state. 
when, well, it is an extremely fast and cunning being, and has killed several recovery agents with both its singularities and claws, emits occasional shrieking sounds, all attempts to communicate have failed. Addendum. Additional objects recovered. Overseers considering conversion of ADRX-19 to a dedicated recovery and containment facility. Reports may need censorship for reasons of security.